Assalamu alaikum. In this video, we are going to be explaining inheritance in Java. Inheritance yani tawrith. In Java, it is possible to inherit attributes and methods from one class to another. We group the inheritance concept into two categories. The superclass, which is the parent or the base, and the subclass, which is the child or the derived class. So the superclass is the class being inherited from. And the superclass, the subclass, is the class that inherits from the other class. Inheritance قلنا يعني إنه توريث يعني شيء class يورث أو يأخذ من the attributes or the methods اللي في the class الأساسي طيب the parent class طيب معنا قلنا إنه superclass واللي هو the class الأساسي والsubclass اللي هو the class الفرعي sub يعني فرعي إنزين الحين الكلاس الفرعي بياخذ كل الاتريبيوتس وكل الميثودز اللي داخل السوبر كلاس او البارنت كلاس and to inherit from a class you use the extend extends keyword extends يعني يبني على يعني ياخذ الاتريبيوتس والميثودز من من الكلاس الاساسي او الكلاس الاب طيب ويبني عليهم يعطي يعطيهم فاليوز او انه يغير فيهم او انه يعني يضيف عليهن أشياء. طيب. Inherited attributes and methods can be used in the derived class. Derived class واللي هو يعني subclass. The class الفرعي. Class as if they had been declared locally. As if they had been declared locally. يعني كأنهن مسويات داخل the class نفسه. The class الفرعي. إحنا نسوي the attributes. والمثلز داخل الكلاس الأساسي وبعدين نستخدم الـ Extend Keyword عشان ناخذ الـ آه مثل هنا ناخذ الـ, الـ Attributes من الكلاس الأساسي Int X نزين وناخذ الـ Attributes من الكلاس الأساسي طيب ونقدر نستخدمهن داخل الكلاس الفرعي كلاس B من الكلاس A ونستخدمهن داخل الكلاس B مع أنهن ما مسوائي لهن Declaration يعني داخل الكلاس الفرعي and then generalization and specialization hierarchy. Generalization will be a superclass. تعميم يعني نأخذ مثلا concept عام مثلا humans. هذا generalization. طيب subclasses of humans يعني الأشخاص كل شخص يعني غير عن الثاني. لكن كلهم يشتركوا في أنهم humans. So يعني الجنراليزيشن الحاجة المشتركة بينهم والسبيشاليزيشن يعني كل حاجة تخت... كل كل كلاس يختلف عن الثاني طيب آه بنعطي أمثلة على هذه and hierarchy يعني ترتيب تصاعدي أو تتر... ترتيب هرمي also called an inheritance hierarchy results of extending class into more specific classes الجنراليزيشن والسبيشاليزيشن are results of extending class into more specific classes. يعني قلنا إنه generalization اللي هو مثلاً humans with specialization كل كل شخص بمفرده يعني. طيب هذا result of extending class to more specific classes. طيب نعطي مثال. عندنا لي human. معنا ثلاث كلاسات father و son و human. طيب the father و the son يشتركوا في أشياء معينة. مثلا انهم humans فكل واحد حاله مثلا اسم so string name so this is a variable that is that will be shared between the father and the son طيب حنا معنا ثلاث كلاسات الكلاس الاول واللي هو الفاضر والكلاس الثاني واللي هو الصن هذه للسب كلاسز يعني الكلاسات الفرعية وهذا الكلاس الاساسي بنسوي humans طيب فالاب والابن humans انزين وبياخذوا الاتريبيوتس من الكلاس الاساسي واللي هو human and humans can walk let's say let's print on the screen the method walk okay let's create the method walk طيب قلنا انه يعني الكلاسات الفرعيه ياخذن من الكلاس الاساسي الاتريبيوتس واللي هن الخصائص والميثودز بعد طيب so let's create a walk method so walk void 
let's create the void method walk and we it's gonna print on the screen that this person this human is walking okay and let's create another method which is eat void eat so we'll print on the screen that um, the human is eating this human is eating okay and then to inherit from another class we need the extends keyword so to inherit from another class you use the in extends keyword طيب نستخدم كلمة extends so extends وبعدين ناخذ اسم الكلاس الأساسي so human extends from human okay so we will take everything from here and we'll give it to the human to the father class and let's do that the same to the son class human okay so this now the son الولد الأب طيب الأب والولد يأخذوا من الكلاس human بثنين تم حالهم name وحالهم walk method وحالهم eat method so now if we go into the main method and we call the we create a a father object so let's create a father object father and we are gonna call him father and we create we give him the we call the constructor method and now we can make the father walk let's let's make the father walk father dot uh, walk okay so as you can see here I'm not typing anything in the father class you see the father class is empty the father class يعني ما في شيء ما مكتوب لا attributes لا methods ولا شيء لكن حنا الحين نقدر نأخذ method من human class ونستخدمها في father class so as you can see this human is walking so يعني الحين الأب human إنسان and he is walking and you can use that to the son also let's create the son class son we're gonna, we're gonna call him son and is equal to new son and end the thing and then you can call the eat method maybe so this human is walking this human is eating so we can call the method the two methods from two different classes and two different objects طيب هذا الجنرالايزيشن يعني هذيل الشيء الكلاسين مشتركين في حاجات معينة طيب بدل نكتب string name بدل نسوي هذيل الأشياء كلهن ونعطيهن كل واحد وحده طيب مثلا نعطي الكلاس الفاضل كلاس نعطيه هذيل كل واحد وحده طيب بس نسوي extends human وبعدين بياخذن كل الاتربيوتس من الهيومن كلاس طيب هذا ال generalization و specialization uh, so let's create a father variable and we are gonna give him an integer variable and we're gonna give him age is equal to 40 40 years old okay and let's give the son age also integer age is equal to um, 13 let's say 13 years old and maybe let's say uh, this guy is going to school so let's create a method so the son will go to school so void void go go to school So we'll print on the screen the boy goes to school and we can give 
the father a method where he goes to work. Let's create that. Go to... Go to work. Okay, so go to work. And this father or this man goes to work. W O R. Okay. O R. And we can, let's see, if I call the object son and I try to get the get go to work method go to work it doesn't work okay because it's only declared here in the father class but if I type it in the human class they will share the same uh, the same method but the son can only go to school as you can see the son can go to school but the father cannot go to school okay so he can only go to work so let's type in the father father dot go to work okay as you can see so the father and the son share the walk method and the eat method but they don't share this the go to school method and the work the go to work method because they are not declared in the um, human class okay so they will not share the same uh, method and they share the same um, age variable because we have declared that declared it in both the classes okay but it's not declared in the human class so we can also print the age of the father and the son son dot age and um, son dot age and we can also do that for the father father dot age you can access both of them because we have declared this age here and this age here Say so a superclass reference can point to a subclass object but not the way the other way around. هذه صراحة ما أعرف شو يعني. ما ما أعرف صراحة. A few moments later. Superclass reference can point to an a subclass object but not to the other uh, way around. Um, هذا يعني يقولنا إنه السوبر كلاس يقدر يسوي اوبجكت من السب كلاس يعني الكلاس الاساسي يقدر يسوي اوبجكت من الكلاس الفرعي لكن الكلاس الفرعي ما يقدر يسوي اوبجكت من آه الكلاس الاساسي طيب يعني الكلاس الاب يقدر يسوي نسخه من الكلاس الابن لكن الكلاس الابن ما يسوي نسخه من الكلاس الاب أم هذه يعني مكتوبة شوية بطريقة مضللة. ف... So as you can see if I if I create a human object so human human واللي هو الكلاس الأساسي أو البيرنت كلاس أو أسمي father اسم father هاي هذا الاسم بس and new and then I type the new keyword and then I use the constructor for the father class it will allow me to do that so father father so we create a human of the type father we give him the constructor of the father class and that will work as you can see I can give him 50 years old and um, name Muhammad Mm, and then you can access his variables dot name and 
other variables um, and this you can print on the screen and his name is Muhammad and then you can use his methods and the other way around doesn't work يعني, so now if I try to do to create a father object so father let's call it human and then we give it the constructor of the main class this human class let's try new human and we give him the age of 30 and then the name Omar and as you can see it gives me an error the error is required type father يعني نحتاج father هنا ما human لأنه هذا الفر... الكلاس الفرعي فما يقدر يسوي object من الكلاس الرئيسي أما الكلاس الرئيسي يقدر يسوي object من الكلاس الفرعي بالconstructor مال الكلاس الفرعي um... and that's it and if you don't want uh, the, uh, the, if you don't want other classes to inherit from a class, you use the final keyword. يعني نستخدم the final keyword عشان نخلي الكلاس ما ما يقدر إن الكلاسات الثانية يسوون له inheritance. طيب بنضيف uh, هذه public final على الكلاس بعدين هنا ما يصير نسوي extends human. طيب so if we don't want that, we can type final. <clears throat> uh, to choose which super class constructor you want, you must call it using the super using the super keyword as the first line in the body of the subclass constructor. يعني إذا بغينا نسوي إذا بغينا نستخدم ال constructor مع ال super class لازم نسويها نستخدم super keyword في أول line في ال the constructor مع ال subclass طيب خلينا نسوي هذا so human first we create a human um, a human constructor okay so let's give the age for both the father and the son Okay, so let's give the age for the both the father and the son. So age will be declared in the human class, so in the parent class. And let's get the the age from this the the age and the name from the the son and the father. Okay, so int age this dot age is equal to age okay and then we have the name so string name we are gonna call it this dot name is equal to name okay طيب هذا الحين سوينا الكونستركتور مال الهيومن كلاس تو عشان نعطي ال um, عشان نعطي الهيومن او الاسم الابن اسم والاب اسم عشان نعطيهم اسم اسماء وعمر الحين لازم نسوي um, constructor حل حل الفاذر وحل السن طيب so father or son let's create the son first son okay and we get two variables which are integer int int age okay and then we get the name string dot string name okay and then we call the uh, super keyword to to get the constructor of human Okay, so in the constructor of son, we call the super keyword, and then we give it the age and the name. 
okay? And this will give the, the agent the name for the sun class, okay? Related problems. We need to give it also here, but we'll create the father first. So father, the constructor for the father, and we're going to give it the two brackets. Okay, and then we take the integer age. We take the name, string name. And then we call the super keyword, super. And then we give it the age. And then we give it the name. Type. And here the constructor mal the human يطلب the age and the name. بنعطيه من the father ومن the son. طيب هذا عن طريق السوبر كيورد السوبر كيورد لازم تكون دائما في أول سطر من الكونستراكتور إذا خليناها في سطر ثاني ما يصير يسي it gives an error you see it gives you an error even though you close the statement and everything so we need أول سطر يعني يكون حتى لو سوينا سبيس ما مشكلة لكن يكون أول أول argument تكون السوبر كيورد عشان نسوي الكول حل constructor مال ل human class and then we give the name for the father let's give the age for the father which is 40 and the name is أحمد and we give the son the age which is 13 and the a, the name will be uh, Omar and as you can see we print the name we print the age we print the age for the son and let's print the name for the father name father dot name and as you can see here it prints 13 for the age of the son and the father will be named Ahmed. Okay? And we can also do the same for the child. Will be name. Alright. Omar and Ahmed. And that is it for inheritance.